Hello, True Believers. Time to do another review. And this time I'm doing something different. A couple of things I'm doing different. One is I'm doing a model kit review. And this one is a Macross figure, as you can see. I'm not too familiar with this series, so I can't tell you much. And another reason why I'm doing this video, this particular video, is I'm recording it in 4K. And the reason why I'm recording it in 4K is because I wanted it to, I want to upload it on YouTube and see what the 4K on YouTube is like on our new 4K TV. I could show you the 4K that on Netflix, they have 4K movies and TV series on Netflix, but the problem is it'll get cut out because of copyright issues or copyright strikes. So I decided, you know what, I'll just make my own 4K video or footage using my iPhone. My iPhone 13 has 4K capabilities, so this video is not gonna be too long. I just wanna show you what the capabilities of it look like. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is the box. So this is, I'm not familiar, like I said, with the series, it's like Macross Frontier. And this is the Mac or the Valkyrie. So it's a VF25S. It's a it's got three modes. It's got Batteroid mode, Fighter mode, and guard, ger, Gearwalk mode, Gearwalk mode. And this is actually an original Bandai. And this was given to me like a hundred years ago by Wes. Wes got this for me. And this is, cause there's times where I get tired of building the usual Gundams. So I wanted to put to get together something different and it was a gift from Wes. So thank you very much, Wes our favorite Hawaiian wherever you are. So let's, so that, so this is the box with the box art and here's what it looks like on the side. So this is an original Bandai. I don't remember what, how much it cost. Oh wait, there it is. 2,800 pesos. Is, so you're talking about like $50. Damn, for this original Bandai, you can get like two or three, you can get like a perfect grade for that same price. But anyway, so there you go, like 50 bucks. So this is what it looks like. I'll tell you the pros and cons. I put this together while we were, I was in prison and just to keep me occupied. Well, well when I became, how, how, can you do, how can you do this while you're in prison? Well, when you became a mayor, you get certain privileges. And one of the privileges is you can, you can bring in certain things that normally wouldn't be allowed. But anyway, let's get to the actual figure itself. You can't, I, there's a lot of detail in it. And I just put the landing gear on it. As you can see, it has, I think it has a, a, a tripod, but you can see the little details inside. And let's take a look inside the cockpit. Let's see if we can zoom in on that. Maybe not. And you can see the decals. And uh, this is made out of, of plastic. So the, the biggest problem with it is that it's very brittle. You can transform it, but you're gonna break it if you do. So I just leave it in this mode, which is probably the best mode. And I remove the hands, so you can't really see. So this is what it looks like underneath. So I this is modeled after the F-15 Tomcat, which is a classic airplane figure. It never gets old, even in space. This is what they use, even though it's already outdated and obsolete but over here when it comes to macross they love using the tom cut the tom cat because it's 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 classic so i, I put these decals on i should focus properly as you can see i i uh, i have the decals decals these are the water slide decals especially this one so I wish I could show you what it looks like when it's transformed, but I, I would for sure break it. But this is what it would look like in the box if you wanted to take a look. So do I like, do I like it? Yes, uh, but it is too expensive, but as a gift, then it's okay. Uh, but I, what I don't like about it is it's very static. You're not gonna be able to transform it because because especially over time, the brittle is going to be, gonna, the plastic is going to be very brittle. And it's going to break easily on you. But it looks fine if you're a big fan of Tomcats and Macross. We 
you could just set it like this on a shelf, on display, and it'll look just fine. Can you transform it? Yes, but and, uh, I would say the plastic is too, too brittle. So that concludes our review. So uh, I, I wouldn't buy it, but if it's a gift, I wouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth. And this is what kept me sane and occupied and from going, driving myself crazy when I'm just focused on building models while I was during my illegal or unjustified incarceration. But anyway, that's today's vlog. I will, uh, there's not much to it. Maybe I'll change it to something else with more action. Maybe one of our shooting videos. But anyway, that's this is my first time uploading in 4K. It's probably gonna take a lot of space. So I'll see you guys in the next vlog. This is Bevels Only.